Good evening. I hope everyone's well. Well, I've been asked quite a few times how I do my pre-made uh, bait bombs, as I call them. I've just made a couple and I tidied up again because I thought, oh, I'll do a video just to keep you keep you informed how I do it. Um, this, I'm not saying this is the, the way everyone has to do it. I'm not saying it's the right way to do it. I'm just showing you how I do it. Um, a few people have asked, so here I am with a, a little video. I've got all the bait there. I had, start rum I had started rummaging through it. And then I thought, oh, I'll quickly get the camera on. So the things you're going to need is tin foil. Tear some into sheets. About, I don't know, that big. <laughs> That's my hand there. You're going to need... A pair of scissors, scrap the knife, use scissors, bait elastic. Um, you could probably use your bait mate. I have done used a bait mate before, I've got a, a, a one in my box, but for pre made ones, I find this little tool fantastic. It's just a, a bit of a bit of bendy plastic, which used to be um, a tube. I think it was off the Ben's um, bubbles, you know, the blow guns. And I just uh, I, I cut it and then sliced it so it's like a bit of a crescent sort of shape on the bottom and it's flexible which is why I like it. So bait bombs. Thanks for tuning in to Sparta Fishing. This is how Sparta, <laughs> this is how Stephen or Sparta or me or whatever you want to call us, um, this is how I do mine. So here we go. Squid, you can put any old bits of squid in. I have got some uh, little strips here. So I can put that on the bottom. The reason I put the squid on the bottom is it's easier to slide off. Uh, next, I put a bit of uh, razor fish in. I've got some razor ready somewhere. I just had it a second ago. Now it's disappeared. Where are you? Oh, that's the razor there. There we go. Just a chunk of razor fish in there. I've got cart here, which I'll, uh, I'll snip the length off. Go on. Doesn't need to be loads. You can you can mix and match whatever you want to put in. Just keep piling it up. And I like to finish it off with a, uh, with some blacks. So. Frozen blacks, I chop them in half, or you can fold it over, do what you want. There you go, so basically I've just filled it up with bits and pieces of bait. Elastic, just start winding it around. Don't do it too tight because it will not come off. So just remember, all you're doing here is, is keeping it together so it can go in the freezer, which I'll show you after. Just nice and lightly. All they're doing, like I say, is keeping it together. I'll put my finger on the top and start going the other way. This isn't to keep it on your hook. This is just to keep it in place. And then just grab your finger on the top like that, and just slide it off into your hand. And there you go. A bait bomb. So that'll go now into... Foil straight in the middle and roll it a few times. Make sure you've got it wide enough so you can just nip the edges up, fold it in so all them good juices stay with the bait. Roll it up. Don't uh, underdo it on the foil and then just nip the ends. And that there is ready for the freezer. So I'll do it one more time if you want. So uh, Got some nice screw here. There's a nice bit of razor. So I generally just, just cut a bit off the squid, just something like that. Open it up. The squid in the bottom. And bit of cart. 
still got the foil on. It's a messy job, like there's no uh, there's no way around it. I feel sorry for the lads who pre prep all the crabs, like they're worth worth their weight in gold, like cheap as out for say 130, 140, get a few baits out. There you go, there's a bit of cotton there. Not a razor. See, you can choose the quantities, you can choose whatever bait you want to put in. Put it on the top and some blacks here. Dun, dun, dun. There we go. Probably fooled that a couple of times. Once, twice, three times, maybe. There we go, just put that on the top. Like that, so it's a nice little pile of bait. Again, I reiterate, don't wrap this hard. The, the purpose of this is to keep it together so it all comes off together. Oh, bugger. Just lightly wrapping it around. Stopping it with my finger. Going back the other way. Stopping my finger, back the other way. There we go, that's enough. Pull that off, splatter the blinds, <laughs> um, thumb underneath, just slide it out, there we go, into the foil, right that, you've got about an inch and a half either side of the bait, Put that in, Nip that in, keeps the juices flowing. I just fold it in at the end. There we go. Straight in the freezer. Bait bombs. And then you've got the big job, make sure you tidy up like it. Because it's a messy job. There's, there's no way around it. I was going to do it in the garage, which I normally do. But uh, the light's terrible in there, so I was worried that you wouldn't be able to get it. And I've got the spotlights above here. So thanks very much for uh, for watching this. Um, I would just like to say thank you so much to all the subscribers. I've got over a thousand now, which is a, a milestone, if you like. And I'm really, really appreciative of everyone that's subscribed, everyone that's commented, everyone that gives a thumbs up. Um, Everyone that's watching the channel. My last video has got 9,000 views and hasn't been on a week. So I'm absolutely buzzing with that. Thank you so, so much. I really do appreciate it. I don't get paid for doing it. I just like to get out there and show you what I'm doing. Like I say, everything I do is just the way I do it. It's not um, It's not the way I'm, I'm preaching to anyone. You go out and do your own thing. You use what baits you want. You decide whether the mark's safe enough. Um, if you see me doing something that doesn't mean it's all right to do it, you know, if you don't feel safe somewhere, then you make your own mind up about that. That's that's spot on. The prize draw from last time. Here we go. So I did say I would give out a few prizes if you commented. Um, there was uh, lots and lots of comments. So me and my daughter sat down and we chose them at random. So here's a little video. From that, let's see if you're a winner. So here we go. My daughter's just going to tell us when to stop. I'm going to press scroll down, and when she shouts stop, I'll stop. And if that's your name on there, you need to email me at the address below. Email me with your um, a screenshot of your page, so I know it's definitely you, um, and your address, and I'll post you a little something out. Might be something to do with fishing. Might be a bit of Sparta merch. Let's wait and see. Little surprise through the post. Nothing big, but just keep seeing rest going. So, are you ready, Isla? Yeah. Right. I have my glorious assistant with us, which is a bit camera shy. Do you want to come here? Come on in. Right. Tell us when to stop. 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 Jim Crossley, 8203. Uh, win another giveaway, nice one. Currently have my can of beer and one of your coasters from the last giveaway. <laughs> Jim, Jim's won again. Right, 
Um, I'll go back to the top. Tell us what to stop. 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 Oh. Oh. Right, tell us what to stop. Stop. Alan Nuts, three, two, eight, five, win. Keep your great videos coming. They're always inspiring. Well, thanks, Alan. Um, that's the idea of the channel, just inspire the people to get out there. Hit the nail on the head, really. Never claim to be a pro. Just want to show you when I'm out there. Right, so that's a couple from that one. I will go back to um, the video, which is also comments on. Uh, we'll pause that. We'll go up to the comments. Hundred and twenty three comments, right? Tell you what, you tell yeah. us when to stop. Stop. Paul Vanderman. There we go, winning. Good to see you at Limemouth again. Thanks for all your videos. So Paul, get in touch, mate. I'll send you something out. Thanks very much. Cheers, mate. Clueless MG Midge, enjoying the videos. I'm hoping to get out soon down targeting at Rye Hope. Win, win, win. So well done, mate. Thanks for uh, thanks for your support. And the last one, I'm going to go back to the top. I'm going to let this one spin a bit. Stop. That's Jim Crossley. Honestly, Jim, <laughs> I can't give Jim two prizes. <laughs> Sorry, Jim. But uh, I'm, I'm doing one each. <laughs> oh look, he's Jim, he's already won one. He's won today and then he would have won again. I'm going to go back to the top, hang on. Okay. Right, give it a good spin. Give it a good spin, good spin. Loads of comments, tell us when. Stop. Charlie Shep, 6361. Let's get the win in, lad. There you go, mate. And that looks like there's a bass in his hand, so I know what I'm going to send him. <laughs> So, uh, well done, Charlie, and thanks to everyone who took part. Cheers. Um, all you've got to do is comment on this video that's on now, um, and I'm going to pick one one random winner. Every single video, I'll just pick a random, but I won't go through this palaver. I'll just pick, on my daughter, I'll pick someone out. So, thanks for tuning in. Right, there you go. So, there's your winners. Um, if you're one of those uh, lucky people, I'll send you out something. It's, they're not massive prizes, it's just a sign of appreciation for, uh, you know, subscribing, etc. Um, all you need to do is email me, there's the email address down below. Email me uh, that you've won with a picture or something that represents your uh, YouTube channel with that name. Because obviously I, I need to clarify whether that's definitely you. I'm not saying there's people out there who are going to try and claim, but just to be fair, uh, shows that that's your channel, just a screenshot of your, your screen or something like that. Um, what else was there? Oh, I so as promised from now on, every video is gonna, I'm gonna send one prize out to a random person. I'll just pick it randomly, I'll not uh, film it doing it like we just did there. I'll just, you just have to trust us on that one. It will be random. Um, and I, so all you've got to do is, is like the videos. You must be a subscriber. Give us a thumbs up and drop a comment underneath if you want a chance to win. So on the next video, I'll tell you who won and uh, get your address and send you something out. So thank you so much for tuning in. Um, stay safe out there. If in doubt, don't go out. That's my advice, especially with MCs at the minute. So take care, everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. All the best.